Hello everyone, uh, welcome to my YouTube channel and welcome to the answer part of the Cerebrum the Open Quiz. Hope you like the quiz. I've tried to make it as like either you heard those things or you have seen those things. Probably even if you found the quiz to be tough, if you see the answer you will say oh this was easy. So here we go with the quiz. The rules were pretty simple, 15 questions and 2 points each and 12 qualifies for the final. So question number 1, we are looking for a particular part, uh, it was said it is a large outer part of brain, controls reading, thinking, learning, speech, emotion and planned muscle movements like walking. So what are we talking about? And I said this is question number 1, obviously what could be the answer? Indeed the cerebrum. I remember one of you asking what exactly cerebrum means. So the question number one is itself cerebrum. That's why I didn't define what cerebrum is. So it was your work to uh, figure out what cerebrum is. So cerebrum is the answer for the question number one of the cerebrum. So cerebrum will give you two points. Question number two, looking for the element that is uh, that was discovered by Marie Curie. So some of you have written curium, but that's not the correct answer. It was named after Q, uh, Marie Curie and Perry Curie, but the answer is polonium, which was named after Poland. So the birthplace of Marie Curie. So polonium is what I was looking for. I said the first line, first line also contained the word Polish. So from there, Poland and you can say polonium. So polonium is good enough. Moving on to question number three. So what in 1860s was developed by him? So this was a straightforward image question. Uh, this one was a bit tough if you are not able, if you are not able to recognize who is he. So this is indeed the Snellen chart. The scientist is Snellen. So by seeing the picture, you can say that, oh, I have seen this. So that's why I said some of you have the experience of using it. So this is nail and chart and if you have explained something related to this like checking the power, you have to see some letters, a box where the letters are, something like that explanation will fetch you only one point and the mentioning of snail and chart will fetch you full two points. So half points and full points. Are also there so this one was a pretty easy question I said which brands logo when I said that a pressure ball you can say and it was given that with a valve to close it off when the air was sucked out from inside the hemisphere and the valve was closed the horse from the pump could be detached and they have were held firmly so something like that like you it was very tough to detach those two hemisphere when this was in the experimental thing so basically the answer is febicol so febicol instead of horse here the power is the elephant so febicol is what i'm looking for mm, so many of you might have confused with levis but levis also have the same funda but the thing is that i said the thing that 1959 so first marketed in India in 1959 so that makes this particular answer to be unique to be only favicol not levis so moving to question number five so what condition is being talked about which literally translate to Christ child so but uh, it happens it leads uh, but whenever it happens it happens uh, uh, whenever it happens it leads to major disruption in the world economics and it was said that near it was said that it develops near the coast of Peru and Australia so what condition is being talked about this is indeed El Nino almost all of you have cracked this answer so El Nino means Christ child or little boy so moving on to question number six it this one was a pretty easy question actually so which software package are we talking about which literally means the word not exactly the software but the word literally means a thick white liquid that is produced by some plants and 
trees especially rubber trees so this was a mixed question of computer science as well as biology so answer is latex so latex will fetch you full two points so latex Moving on to question number 7, this one pretty easy question, uh, patent diagram of each particular object. You can see the lower diagram gives the idea of a speaker and the microphone, something like that. So this is indeed the telephone, receiver or, and the microphone you can see. So question number 8, so what solution is being talked about, I gave you the clue. if in a science quiz a solution is being talked about this should be the first case and it is said that when the Nazis invaded Denmark in April 1940 the Hungarian chemist Jos de Hevesi put the Nobel Medal of Max and James so the answer is indeed aqua regia so nitric acid in three proportion and hydrochloric acid in one proportion that will make aqua regia so aqua regia full two points we want to question number nine so what does this particular structure which supplies an astronaut with oxygen and communication and also keeps him connected and tethered to the spacecraft during the spacewalk so what it is named aimed which is after physical feature found in many mammals so this is indeed umbilical cord so umbilical cord good enough so umbilical cord is the cord basically which connects the baby from the mother and it gets the food and the nutrition from the mother's body through umbilical cord for placenta there is no point since the answer is umbilical cord the structure in the astronauts gear is umbilical cord the answer is only umbilical cord no points for placenta and i would say placenta was a very good guess but no points for that question number 10 identify him and also state after which particular announcement last year he was in news i said the uh, please think about the most famous announcement in the science field and the most famous announcement in a year in the science field is obviously the Nobel prizes and the answer is Amal Rai Chaudhary, the Rai Chaudhary equation in the general relativity. So after Dr. Penrose was awarded the Nobel prize in physics, so this professor came into limelight. So moving on to question number 11, so I said think something 18 plus can relate but I said don't think in a wrong way so this is silver nitrate and I said the industrial standard of something contains 10 or 14 or 18 percent of this solution so what exactly is this so this is indeed the indelible ink or the voting ink so voting ink indelible ink good enough so the voting age is 18 and if you are 18 plus you get to vote and this is the thing which contains the uh, 10 or 14 or 18 percent of silver nitrate moving on to question number 12 it is uh, like dash baby is a baby born after a miscarriage stillborn or neonatal death and there was a pretty obvious in it is called so because it is like dash after a storm so it is dash like after a storm something beautiful so what beautiful thing comes into your mind when we talk that this particular thing happens after a storm so the answer is rainbow so these are called the rainbow babies so rainbow baby good enough beautiful thing after storm rainbow we want to question number 13 what it is called in Malayalam so this flower which is called Halkusha in Bengali Goldura in Punjabi if you see clearly that it is called Thumbai in Tamil and Thummi in Telugu so it was pretty obvious from there only that this is Thumba so known for its rocket launches so if you don't know 
what thumba is or which place is thumba please google it and check out what thumba is so known for it lock, rocket launches moving on to question number 14 so which structure is being talked about 3.5 ton structure stands on 3 ton base i said this is not for beautification purpose but it has a totally scientific reason for what oh, why it is what it is doing there so this is indeed victoria memorials dome or you can say that, that particular structure victoria so that acts like a lightning conductor that's not for beautification if you ever visited kolkata obviously you would visit victoria memorial and the structure above the dome is not just for beautification but for uh, it acts as a lightning conductor move on to question number 15 which was the last question so who is the inventor padmashri so he was determined to continue with building machine and he built lots of machines and also got lots of patent under his name so the answer is Uddhav Bharali Uddhav Bharali full two points so that's all from Cerebrum e, thank you for participating in the quiz so with uh, so wait for the results so answers are already here so wait for the results thank you for participating and if you haven't subscribed the channel do subscribe the channel over and out